I guess I was kind of lucky in the fact that I knew from an early age exactly what I wanted to do, and that was to fly. So I decided to become a helicopter pilot in the Army. I'd already secured a place at the Royal Military Academy Sandhurst, um, but they'd given me some advice and said, well, you're 17 at the moment, we'd like you to get a little bit of life experience before coming to join the Academy. So at the age of 18, I didn't go to university. I took a year out and um, I decided to go on an Operation Rally expedition to Alaska for three months. Now the expedition to Alaska really was, for me, um, quite a, I, I think a pivotal moment in my life. And one of the phases of our expedition was to kayak around Prince William Sound from Valdez to Whittier. So we set off with about three weeks worth of food in our kayaks. Um, and it was after about a week and a half that we realized that we didn't have three weeks worth of food in our kayaks. We'd, we'd only gone off with 50% of rations for, for one reason or another. So we had to cut back and, and start foraging and fending for ourselves and we were fishing, um, we were supplementing our food. I think I've always been somebody who's enjoyed a challenge. Um, I, I always enjoy both you know, physical and mental challenges. The challenges that I've faced subsequently in life, be that in my career as a, a military pilot or in my current career as an astronaut, I often go back to that period and, and draw on lessons learnt and um, use that experience really as a foundation for building on the, on the future of how to deal with difficult situations. I'm Tim Peake, an astronaut with the European Space Agency.